feedback that I get from the English department, from our standardizing testing and so on, is that we have a fairly strong English department here. Uh, we're making gains across the board, but it's in English where I think the real concerted effort on the teacher's part working together uh, has really made a measurable difference. And we have a really good group and we work together to try and build on skills. We're all committed to making sure that the students succeed and um, we know that things have to build on each other, especially in English. They're not separate classes. I teach half the juniors and all the seniors, and by the time I get the seniors, I know what they know or should know, and I'm able to focus in on the things that they're going to need to make that transition over to college. In English, you need to build on the skills of the class that came before, with whether it's writing, reading, discussion, etc. And so we want to make sure that we know what those skills were and that they were developed um, properly and systematically. In the last few years, we have focused on the English department because we realize that the literacy, the ability to read, the ability to write well uh, is crucial to every other course they're going to take and particularly of course to a college career. The successes are the small moments when you see the light go on for the student, when you see them get engaged and you know that you've got their attention and that they're truly um, understanding and seeing the bigger picture. We have a passion for what we do. Uh, if you're doing something with a passion, and suddenly the clock doesn't matter so much. In fact, time can fly by. Uh, your days aren't a, a drudgery, they're an adventure. And what I can say about working with my staff is I've never once uh, not been impressed by their enthusiasm, their, their desire for st a student performance, uh, their encouragement and nurturing nature toward our students. I see that every single time I go into one of their classrooms. The students give me energy. There is a certain vitality to our interaction. It is something that pushes me on, lets me know that I'm in the right place. The teachers hands down are the best at their craft. They're getting 16 year olds to read Macbeth. They recognize that we just need to get the kids to read and to talk about what they're reading. We do a lot of things that are very much um, team-based, um, project-based. I almost never give a lecture. You know, every answer that I give, I don't give it to them. I say, what do you think? It's almost Socratic. And so they have to think. They can't ever just sit back and, you know, hide into their book. Um, I'm always in calling on them, always encouraging them to present, to discuss, to read, to write, and I think that that's essential for any class that they'll be in in college. The smooth feel of my pen allows me to soar and glide across blue lines. I am my pen. We have in many ways uh, thought about and reworked what we do in the English department to strengthen it. Uh, students have two different courses that they take in the freshman year in order to strengthen their reading and writing skills. It kind of focuses on getting their academic skills more up to par so they're able to take those challenges that are coming their way as sophomores and juniors and seniors. Just this year we have uh, added the program of Reading Counts which gives them a lot more exposure to reading uh, and then analyzing and discussing the reading that they do. Not just students understanding what they read but reading for entertainment as one of the choices they would have for filling idle time. More and more of our students with this program that ties their independent reading to part of their English grade, we're getting more of that buy-in. That reading is something of value, not just for my grade, but you know, there are stories that have some interest for me. The more that they read, the better they will be at writing, at analyzing, at the types of literature that we read in class. Reading is fundamental. You know, that would be one of the. Th I mean, it's a, a catchphrase and a cliche, but it's something that, if parents are also supportive of a student's reading, that kind of reinforcement at home not only uh, bolsters our efforts here at school, but it's going to pay dividends. Uh, their success in college is so tied to their reading abilities that um, we can't let that slide. I really love what I'm doing, I love the students, and I know that I need to do a lot to get them where they need to be. You know, it scares me sometimes a little bit where they come in and where they need to go in the four years or even in the year that I have them, and so I want to make sure that I can do everything in my power to get them where they need to be.